I was a contestant on the reality show America's Next Producer. I made it to the final two, and you know, the judges just said, you know, nothing but wonderful things about me. the playroom that's great and you know what else is important to keep clean what the planet i actually felt good as the piece was being reviewed as i was looking at the judges faces and i knew that we did something creative and educational and fun good leela claude what'd you think i loved it i thought uh the concept of recycling was wonderful where'd clean and green come from it, well, the idea of the whole show popped in my head, clean, green, and self-esteem, just as like a title of this episode. Who came up with the idea of going from cleaning up the room to cleaning up the planet? I did. Very good. Who named Shelby, by the way? Who came up with the show? Very nice. Yes. I think she displayed great leadership skills. Yes. Yeah. It was her that finally crystallized the idea that you go from cleaning the room to cleaning the planet, which, yeah. which nailed the segment. So, and Jessica, what was the issue you chose? Recycling plastic bottles. Great, let's see it. It's amazing the power that we have in our hands. Every day, 40 million of these bottles get thrown away. It takes a thousand years for one bottle to degrade. If you recycle it, it only takes 80 days. Now, let's do the math. 40 million bottles, a thousand years per each bottle. That's 40 billion years worth of trash every day. I do think our PSA is going to be the one to win. I think it has a clear message. It's bringing awareness to viewers. Responsibility for who did the most on your piece? Um, I stepped in front of the camera. He set up the shots. I shot it. I did the audio. Right. I edited it. Right, right. And I never edited before two weeks ago. She stepped up. Genius. First, congratulations. You both did excellent work. And it's something that we want to use on our website nrdc.org. Our 1.2 million members and hundreds of thousands of other people look at that site all the time. This will be a great addition to it. Thank you so much. So, and Jessica, you can leave the studio. Thanks, Thank guys. You. Thank you so much. My final project is called Welcome to Haggerty's. Brilliant. I love my project, and it's great, and I have an amazing cast. I do have one celebrity, Joyce DeWitt from Three's Company, is one of my characters. My director of photography put me in touch with Joyce, and she said after 30 years since Three's Company, she's had hundreds and thousands of scripts across her desk, and this was the first one that actually sparked her interest. Welcome to Haggerty's. I want to go to our expert in this field. David Nevins, what did you think? Yeah, I actually thought that, that the presentation tape was, was incredibly well done. Yeah, I think, in general, your casting was really good. Well, you also said that was very important, so I spent all my efforts and budget and everything on my cast. There, there's a real situation here, which there wasn't before. You had a place with funny characters, mm -hmm. and now there is something going on that is going to set them against each other mm -hmm. in a sort of a classic way. Jessica got... Joyce to wit. She got Joyce to freaking wit. You know, I thought that was like great. Uh, so I mean, like, I mean, yeah, that's that's TV right there. She she does live and breathe TV. That one just seemed like the polished one. It was more believable. I was more convinced. I was more kind of into you, it. Like you oh, were more entertained by yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, and, and it felt like a show to me. Jessica's was put together like a pro. Jessica. You delivered an entertaining and really well executed presentation. What you put on that screen, with the resources we gave you, it was incredible. <laughs> the winner of America's Next Producer is... Gwen. Fortunately, I lost, but I really don't think I lost. I think what doesn't kill you only makes you stronger. And since I didn't win, it's fueled me to become America's Next Producer, regardless of what they had to say.